Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be demonstrating the Rudiger row using sodium bicarbonate. Um, I guess a lot of people just refer to it as baking soda. Uh, it's kind of odd that I'm using this because uh, oftentimes people use this to put out fires, uh, not to make them. But you will see that it works as a really good catalyst here for the Rudiger row. Um, I'm just simply rolling it up in a cotton ball here. I'm going to be using in this first demonstration using sodium bicarb, uh, a brick base, and a uh, wooden handhold, just a plank. Uh, I will demonstrate it again in the woods in my favorite little hiding place, but for right now I'll show you how it works in a more urban setting. Um, here you just see me rolling it up. Uh, guys, uh, sodium bicarbonate uh, has a lot of uses, uh, you know, besides uh, putting out like grease fires, which is one of the first ways I saw it used. Um, I've also uh, had it used uh, to clean teeth, and uh, I used it as a mouthwash myself. I have heard of people using it for the purpose of uh, cleaning battery terminal ends as well. I'll go over a few more uses in a minute, guys. Here I'm just showing you that I have a nice ember and how well it works. I'll be moving on to uh, my little hiding place here in the woods. <laughs> You're one of my favorite hiking places. Um, as I'm demonstrating, I'll go ahead and go over a few more uses uh, for sodium bicarbonate. Um, Everybody, I guess, I think I already mentioned uh, the stomach acid, and if not, uh, that's a big, big use that people have used it for in the past. Um, rough or dry skin, if uh, you have rough or dry skin and need an exfoliant to use, uh, sodium bicarb or baking soda is really good for that. Uh, I know that in the past I had used it, or my cousins had used it rather, I'd made it for them, um, a poison ivy medicine, if you want to call it that and also to soothe insect bites. I have heard uh, in the past, and I can't remember where I read this, that <clears throat> people had used it to protect their kidneys uh, from radiation damage. Now, I've also heard that people store it for that purpose uh, in the event of a nuclear attack that they would want to have a lot of it on hand um, to help protect their kidneys and their skin with. Um, here I am guys just simply rolling it up there are all kinds of uses guys for sodium bicarbonate I mean it's just uh, it's a really wonderful thing to have especially if you're into prepping or you know taking uh, budget materials with you out into the woods and as demonstrated here even with my crappy materials left out in the elements <laughs> that are slippery I'm still able to easily get an ember using the sodium bicarb with uh, the cotton. And it's actually going to kick back on me here in a second and I have to get it up off the ground real quick. And there it is. But guys, I want to thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to post, go ahead and below. It's not necessary. But uh, have a good night or rather a good afternoon. <laughs> and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.